Hello friend, this is Ryan Hicks, TalkToProfit.com. And today I want to talk about the importance of your faith, what you believe you will experience, what you believe about life. I was talking to someone today and they were talking about how it's so hard to find good people that everywhere you go there's always bad people and problems and all this stuff. But this individual chooses to be around people who are their friends who are problematic. They either drink or smoke or do other things and have other vices and personality problems that cause more issues. But see, they're expecting the worst and they're hanging around the worst people and they wonder why they're experiencing the worst out of humanity. You could certainly be expecting the best and, and have interactions with people who aren't the greatest. But I'm going to tell you the most common thing, if you have that positive mental attitude, if you have that high vibrational state of expecting the best, of actually following Philippians 4.8, not just talking about it, but your thoughts are always on positivity, that's going to be the vast majority of what you experience. And I even had this person relent and say, well, you're probably right, but they don't make any changes. It's just, well, you know. There's always bad people, and you know this bad thing always ha You know something always bad's going to happen. If you have something good happen, there's going to be some equal bad thing. No. Stop telling yourself lies and putting faith in the worst. Putting faith in negativity. Putting faith in the devil. Why are you going to believe for bad things in your life? Why are you going to believe for a world and an experience of negativity? Why would you want to believe for that? And yet so many people do. And they'll tell themselves, well, that's just what I experience. No, it's what you believe for. And you keep believing for it. So you keep experiencing it. Then that reinforces your faith and you keep believing for it some more. And it's a never ending cycle, a self-fulfilling prophecy that builds upon itself and reinforces itself. And you keep prophesying, you keep believing for it and you keep getting it. My friend, you have to change your words. You have to change your mentality to change your thoughts and think those things that are true, that are honest, that are just, that are pure, that are lovely, that are of good report, that are virtuous, that are praiseworthy. My friend, think on these things and get the abundant life that Jesus came to give you. My friend, I pray this is a blessing for you. May God bless you richly.